Hello guys, hello and welcome to another episode of Hearts Farm 4, Obese America and No Mod. Last episode we liberated Poland and we... Well, we didn't li really liberate <laughs> Baltic nations. But, um, well, we did liberate the Balkans, or not all the Balkans, but um, most of the Balkan nations. <laughs> um, yeah, and we also are now invading pure Russian te or Soviet Union territory. Very good distinction to do. Um, yeah, so, uh, well, I think we should just unpause and let's go. As you might see, convoys are always tricking me in the beginning. It's like, yeah, you have enough convoys for everything. And then like, nope, as soon as I unpause. Because it updates trade routes and everything like that. So, yeah. Damn it, get... Wait, I still have 120 left. We have enough convoys right now. What the... What the hell? But you were taking 1.7... Never mind then, never mind then, we're fine with convoys, we're finally, finally fine with convoys. And as you might see, it's rolling a hell of a lot better than last game. And I did no difference at all. I don't know, my computer wants to die sometimes, and I just realized I, I don't have my small little base cam up here. Um, it should be on. I have no clue why it isn't on. That should be on. That ev everything. Ev what? <gasps> Has the face cam completely broken? Deactivate. I'm gonna deactivate. I'm gonna activate it again. It's on. And let's see if I show other ones. No, you seem to be broken somehow. Oh, <gasps> holy shit! Then I guess I will just have to... Well, then it's actually necessary for me to buy a new one. Right away. Holy crap. Alright. Um, I was gonna... Well, I was still gonna buy one. Like, now it's just critical that I buy one ASAP. Alright. Alright, let's just do it then. On... Probably way, on my way work... On my way home from work tomorrow. Hmm. Alright, so uh, we'll just have to skip it this episode, but I don't think a face cam or not a face cam is gonna make the biggest difference between Soviet Union and us. They are falling. They are falling really, really quickly, and it's really, really beautiful to see. Especially since we had so much trouble right in the beginning. Like, we had a struggle, we tried to invade right here, we tried to invade right here. Or actually, this invasion kind of worked, so never mind. We tried to invade right here. But we really just failed quite badly. But now, slowly but steadily, we have been advancing and we're doing fine now. We liberated all the allies. We have just generally done really, really well. So I can't really complain about anything. Well, I could still complain about heavy tanks being god-awfully expensive and making it impossible to actually produce enough of them. So I guess I can always complain about that. And let's just unmark you. Let's just unmark... Not anything more. <laughs> Let's add three more factories right here. Actually, we have a ton of them already. It's just that factories are being destroyed and I can't use any of them. Never mind, never mind. Let's just then have on construct repair and just hope that some of them get him fixed. Until that moment, let's just continue pushing in as aggressively as we possibly can. You are not pushing aggressively at all, but I'm gonna tell you to be very, very aggressive r right now. Because, well, I just wanna eat them up as quickly as possible right now. Uh, let's see, we do have a single tank right here and a single division. I think the single division can continue on and just grab some more land. This tank in this division can go in and just bring down the loss of a tune division right there. <coughs> God, if we only had more supply. Like, if supply was fine in this region, then I believe Soviet Union would have already fallen. But since, well, it very much isn't, we have a slight problem. Uh, we're gonna just advance this line a tiny bit more. Let's just, actually not do a tiny bit more. Let's just do a hell of a lot more. Since we don't seem to have any real problems of, uh, well, needing to change our front line at all. We're just slowly but steadily moving in right now. So let's just have our front lines reflect that as well. All right, come on, stop giving me research bonuses. Let's just, come on, follow my line, follow, follow my arrow. Wh 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 what's the problem with you? I kind of took you like here, then I did like this. Okay, you were doing that with, but that one didn't. 
weird. Uh, anyway, you just move up right here. Come on, come on, stop messing around. Thank you. And then we're gonna do the same thing right here with the blue one, but I'm gonna have you a tiny bit more just like this because it's important that we grab Leningrad. That's a hell of a lot of victory points, and I really want it. Come on, come on. Stop messing with me. I'm gonna right click. There we go, and I'm gonna mark you like. No, not all the way, and there we go. That's much better. So, which line was it? You died. That super heavy tank division died. That's the only thing that can explain why you disappeared from me right now. That super heavy tank division died. Holy shit. I just want to double check that right now. We have two of them. One of them is right here, and the other one is right there. So yeah, it died. This only super heavy tank division I had died off. Huh. Seems like they are, well, not the best. Most likely because, well, you are, are extremely slow, and someone just manages around you and kill you while we're pushing this aggressively, especially since we don't have very much supply. Um, one thing I'm gonna do right here with my armor division is say hello, normal tank. Uh, right there. I'm just gonna remove you To be honest We still have super good stats and everything will be 100% fine and I just believe we're gonna solve most of our tank issues this way and let's see this is super heavy tank production Yeah, then I'm fine with it Come on From division reinforcements. Yeah 500. It solved some of the problems not all of them But some of them and I think I'm gonna do actually the same for mechanized if I can if I just remove one division right here, we still have okay stats and let's see, how are we doing with mechanized? By doing that, we are fine with mechanized. That's really good. So everyone else just continue pushing right now. Actually, everyone can just regroup at your front line and then we'll see. Supply wise, oh god, that, that supply is just horrendous. I can't find any other way of explaining it. Just, okay, let's push in manually like this then. Let's try to make this a big surround. And all the, all the guys right here, let's just go for Moscow. They should not be able to stop. They shouldn't be able to stop me, right? really, to be honest. No, I still want to go to Moscow. I just want to select a couple of you, like you two. Oh, you two, I'm selecting several tanks right now. Uh, let's grab one of them and just move forward. So, yeah, let's just bring down the important stuff right now and let's see. Uh, Soviet Union, how far are you or how close are you to actually surrender? Very, very far away. Wow, that's <laughs> Like I said very very far away and I don't think we will see anything. I was thinking maybe we can bring them down during this episode, but Now seeing those stats. I am very very doubtful about that Maybe if we manage to get a couple of nukes done, but that's gonna take a time. That's gonna take a hell of a long time uh, Let's see there were s at some place we could ac actually it was our small islands we produced some nukes but yeah we don't have that anymore hmm can we produce any more nukes somewhere else uh, not really that's that's too bad convert this building no I would love to destroy you though but since we're at war we can't destroy it I'm pretty sure that's the reason I'm actually not 100% sure now when I mention it. Anyway, uh, what's important is that we just continue bringing down all this nation and do not let them recover anyway or regroup or anything similar. Let's just bring down all this territory as quickly as possible and hope it works. Uh, you guys, we still have a couple of troops going for Moscow and we have some troops right here that have, well, gone for and succeeded in taking Leningrad. Very, very good. You're supposed to go right here, you're supposed to go out a bit more, you're supposed to go out like this, and the last division lets you send you through Novgorod and take those bonuses. You, let's see, you should go like that. Perfect, perfect. I think that's gonna be pretty goddamn awesome. So clean up that territory and let's see, how close are, are you to surrendering right now when we're taking Leningrad? 73% uh, and you're gonna surrender when you have 10% or less, so barely any difference. Uh, we're gonna get a nuke in... Uh, a couple of days only so I think it's time for us to just move up all of these air forces you're gonna move up like this you guys you're gonna get uh, over there and move out to Belarus you are gonna get 
that. Let's see, move that right there and move to Ukraine and you guys. Let's see, right there and I guess additional stack on Belarus. Actually, no, no, you are going to be assigned right there while you are going right there. Otherwise, we can't defend that territory and that means you. No, 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 you're going to still be right there. No, no, stay, stay and assign right there while you guys, let's see. You were supposed to go right there and then defend that territory. So basically a chain of defense. And you guys, I don't remember exactly where wa where I was supposed to put you. Oh, right there. Oof, Belarus. You had no fighter support at all. Uh, let's see if we can get some strategic bombers now out and ready. Because we're going to need them to drop those bombs. Those nuclear bombs. Wait, 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 really? We haven't captured a single strat bomber or done anything like that? Really? Huh. Uh, hello, uh, how are even that researched? Really? Don't tell him, don't tell him I don't even have research. It's gonna take ages. Hello, submarine operations. Hello, strat bombers. 123 days and not a single one has been captured oh actually 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 wait wait request aircraft where are my strat bombers hello strat bombers i don't care that they're quite expensive so that's gonna cost me five civilian factories but it's gonna cost me five civilian factories and i can just instant reduce them which is very very nice i'm giving you top priority because i need them well i need them right now so come on, just give me something. Right now. As soon as we see a number one right here, we're just gonna instantly deploy it. P which parliament debates intervention in Scandinavia? Well, um, you kind of failed with your defense of Norway, so I don't know if you should intervene other otherwhere in Scandinavia. You have a bunch of division stations right here, but, well, can't you just, well, I don't know, liberate Norway with those divisions instead of intervening Planning to intervene probably in Denmark, Sweden, and Finland. Not, not that I'm saying that Norway is not in Scandinavia. It's just, well, maybe you should look to your failures and try to, well, recover from them. And I don't see a single division on this basically entire front line. So, what you know, what the hell are you doing? Are you really focusing that much on the well east side, while I'm invading the most important territory that you have? Or was it just that I captured your entire front line, which I very much doubt. Not impossible, but I very much doubt that I managed to capture your entire front line. Uh, let's see, can we grab a single division right here? Yes, you can be grabbed. I want you to go like this. Just clean up this territory. Yep, yeah, perfect. Philippines want to be called in? I still say no. You're my dear, dear puppet, and you're not supposed to be involved in any single war. I just scrolled way too fast right there. Fall of Moscow, very good. You're not in a single war, right? Yeah, you're not in a single war. Only, only thing that's happening right now is that you are, well, volunteer. <laughs> I don't know if I should say volunteering your troops to me, since I kind of forced them to join me. But um, you have a couple of forces that are, well, have joined me in this battle. Honorably, of course. And let's see, these black... Ac actually, let's just assign you to the main front of you. That's better. Most likely. Uh, let's see, can I deploy you ahead of time? Yeah, sure. Then let's deploy you ahead of time. I just want more divisions on the front. You're, you're just going to be deployed right here. And then we're going to reassign you once you have arrived. The carrier has arrived. Uh, Stalingrad, it's time for you, I think. You're my third enemy. Oh crap, we should have strat bombers right now, and I did not manage to nuke uh, Moscow before that happened. That's kind of bad, to be honest, since that would give in, well, the biggest reduction in national unity. So, I guess Stalingrad will just have to do. Uh, we don't have any defense right there, so you can just move all right there. Uh, together with you guys, once you have actually been deployed, come on. 29%, 31 40% and that's gonna be a nice little nuke down on Stalingrad and it's gonna be beautiful you're gonna lose well some score wait wait I can still nuke them 
Why can I nuke you right now? All I have is tackle bombers. What? Tackle... No. Tack bomber shouldn't be able to nuke, right? Wide var variety of missions. Uh, sure then. Le let's let's just drop a nuke then. Fine. I I'm completely fine with this. All I want really is to drop you. So even if we don't get exactly what we want, let's see. 82%, yeah, that's fine. A very nice nuke right there. Let's see. It was 10%. Let's see. You currently have 18%. So another 8%. Was increased right there. So that's very, very good. All of you are just atomic bombing of Stalingrad. First and hopefully last time in history, a nuclear bomb has been detonated in Stalingrad as part of the international warfare. Ah, <sighs> God. Always nuke. The atomic area has truly begun. Indeed. Indeed it has. But right now, I guess it feels a tiny bit like Soviet Union have just given up right now. They realize that they have lost. So right now they're trying to beat down their enemy quickly enough in the east so they can deal with me in the west I severely doubt that they will be able to do it I see one division right here one division right there I see one division right here and one in the north so basically I have five divisions stationed against me and that's not gonna be enough for well even a short time they're just gonna be well removed ASAP you can continue actually. I just want a bunch of division right there to clean this up because it goes so much faster doing it that way. Uh, you can actually just go straight to Stalingrad. Yeah, and I think I will do something like this. Actually, uh, let's check resistance. Yeah, it's pretty much this entire area just filled with resistance. I can't do anything about it. Hmm. I kind of want a couple more just <laughs> nuclear reactors. Huh. I guess I can just fill out Italy because it's a very easy way, easy place to beat down all resistance on if I have to. So I guess I could always just remove a couple of these divisions just, well, start this garrison right here. Just beat the crap out of them, but um, for now I'm just gonna say it's fine. Uh, every, every single division just hold right now and spread out a bit more you're gonna be assigned right here you're gonna remove this and you or someone just remove this because right now we are getting a hell of a lot of division assigned right here when it's completely unnecessary so another day and uh, we're gonna take it very good we have 54 percent until another nuke you are almost going for uh, Stalingrad then um, please just rush for it instead uh, we have another city right there. We have another city right there. Any other cities? I think we have one in northern. Yeah, right there. Just rushed. Yeah, basically just rush the cities right now. VP rush because they don't have anything right here. Then I'm gonna. Well, I'm gonna make them pay for it. And then you're gonna move up like this. If you don't want any troops on your victory points, then fine. But I'm gonna make you pay for it. I'm gonna take everything just ASAP and make sure that I win by doing it. Uh, you need to, actually both of you can go the same way and see if you can grab both of it. All right, we also have Sevastopol that needs to go down. Uh, let's see, you guys can go right there. Actually, that's very unnecessary. Uh, let's just halt. Uh, let's just do this. Halt, 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 halt. Then grab you, you, and you. No, actually, let's just grab them. Let's see, you are free tank divisions from the same group. Then let's move it down right there. And then unselect that and then go for the capital. Come on. And then go for the capital. There we go. Much better. <laughs> Messed up a tiny bit right there. But it's all alright. Current losses, 344,000 versus 8.3 million. So... You can kind of see who's winning. I don't want to give a, give anything away, but I'm pretty sure I, we can pretty much call me winner. 
I'm not 100% sure yet, but no, of course I'm 100% sure yet. We're gonna slaughter them, especially since whatever happened right here. They're just falling back. It seems like they just wanna, well, save Russian lives right now. Which is kind of logical in real life, but in this game, not really. Uh, let's see, you, yeah, everyone is just going for it straight ahead. Uh, you can stop and just go, st no, stop, stop, what are you doing? Stop, no, stop. Stop it. Go straight there, thank you. <laughs> it really refused to go right there. Uh, let's see, the tank I set on Stalingrad, will you be able to do it? Maybe. It seems like you're meeting some resistance. Maybe, maybe, maybe that Marine can do any difference. And of course, as soon as I assign you, you break through. Even before the Marine managed to actually do anything. How close? 43%. 40% out of 18. Okay. Cool, we grab this. Very good. Let's just get in right here then and bring them down. Uh, I see another city down there. Please just go and grab it. Uh, we actually have quite a bit of many cities quite a bit of cities right here in the very far south uh, you can go right here you split in half and go right there grab the other one to go right there and then I'm gonna grab you orange ones to go right there and I don't remember I set anyone to go right there so let's just do it that should basically be it I think because very very shortly we have another nuke and that nuke will probably be dropped at Actually, they don't really have any big cities left, so it might just not be dropped at all. Because I don't see a reason. Maybe, 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 maybe if we find a decent sized city somewhere else, but you most likely don't have any. Japan have already taken it in the far east, so I think it's fine. Um, here's a 5. Is that really your best one? It might be. So let's grab you guys together with the tactical. Uh, let's assign right here. Oh good. All of you can actually be assigned there from that entire way And let's just wait a couple of days and see if we actually have another nuke Otherwise, we'll just have to go in and grab the lost victory points And since the game is probably well, it's much better than last time, but it's still pretty goddamn laggy I think I will just call the campaign really. I want to start something new We have so many campaigns now going on for like part how many parts do I actually have of like United States 12? More than that, maybe? I thought it was gonna be a super quick campaign, that's why I decided on doing it. But this is already part 13. Not really what I planned when I began this episode, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, I think once Soviet Union falls, I will actually call it because there won't really be a challenge anymore uh, to bring down Japan, especially in this super laggy environment so hopefully i can i think i'm gonna start the molten campaign that you requested a while ago because that was also super popular and very highly voted so i think i will begin with that one and uh, let's see what else can we do well we will continue with the korean one we will continue with of course all the other ones as well uh yeah i think i'm pretty good and uh, let's see before you go in right there just nuke it once now we can go Basically, all I want is them to lose a tiny bit more natural unity, which might might make it possible for me to, once I grab it, well, you will actually fall. Uh, you can just continue forward like this. Uh, these two divisions, what the hell are you doing? Half of you are supposed to go right there. Well, half of you right there, and half of you... There wasn't another one, never mind. Uh, then let's go in and grab this. The rest of the divisions are just generally pushing forward. Uh, let's see, can't you guys get over there? That's another 5 points, thank you. Okay, we managed to grab that city, you are grabbing that city, very good. You're pushing in right here. Come on, just go like this now. No, just, just follow the border. And then we'll clean this up slowly but steadily. I want all 42 blue division to be assigned right here. To the main front line really. Because that's just basically cleaning up. They don't have very many divisions and assigned basically anywhere, so let's just clean it up. Uh, right here, let's just go for maintenance. We should probably have <laughs> assigned that on my divisions. Uh, yeah, we do have logistics at least. <laughs> I was kind of half expecting me to just have forgotten about that because so I saw a comment about it in the video. But yeah, 
luckily we at least had that. Come on, go in and grab that capital. Very good. And let's see how close are you to surrendering right now. 25-18. Anything right here in the far east? No, I don't think so. So it might just be that we have to grab more land. Ugh. Kind of kind of sensible that we have to grab more land because, well, they have so much. But kind of annoying. <laughs> Just fall. Just admit it. You have fallen completely. Uh, you go like this and just clean out this entire area. Thank you. Uh, then you guys just go in like this, and you can go. You can go down straight there and push you right there, and that should be the entirety. Uh, maybe not right there. So let's just, for for safety reasons, add you separately. Thank you. Otherwise, just cleaning up basically everywhere. You guys just move straight ahead in there. You guys are moving right there. You're walking into that province. I want you to just clean up this area, if you please. Thank you. And right here, well... Not something super interesting, but something that has to be done anyway. Yeah, that's all provinces. Oh, actually, that's more than all provinces. Uh, let's go around right here. No. Don't forget about that province. Go right there. Go into this province. Take all of those. And then include those three. Thank you. And let's see. You tanks. Let's see. You two can go the very far south right here. And go in like this. While you red divisions. You're supposed to go the very north. And then go in. Cool. That's going to clean up the entire deal north. I probably need a division. Let's say. Let's take you. And just clean out that area. Very good, and the rest of you are just constantly pushing in. Very good. They are very, very close to surrendering right now, but it's actually, actually, not very close. Uh, let's see, do you have any other city? Yes, you have. Oh, that one is a 10 even. Oh, crap, I should have nuked that one instead. Uh, that would have given me more, or that would have reduced in a unit by even more. Uh, let's see, do you have an Air Force sign right in that area? Yes, we do. Actually, no, we don't. Let's sign everything I have right here. Come on, just don't fail in this. Just bring it down. Just bring it down ASAP now. Come on, come on, you can do it. You can do it. Just bring them down. <laughs> uh, you are cleaning up all of this. Uh, you are not doing it efficiently, so let's just fix it. Like that, and I want you guys to move in like this and up, and you can just go straight there. Thank you. You guys are gonna go exactly like that. Perfect. No objections at all right there. Come on. Right here. So, we're invading that area from several different directions. Push them back, sir. That's what you said, but are you really? Are you really? Uh, let's go in like this and make sure that we don't have that freaking reaver penalty. I see a super heavy tank is coming right here. Then uh, sure, if you want to help me bring that down, please do. Uh, you can actually help attack him right now so we get that extra combat width. But otherwise in that, um, well, let's just wait a little bit. And uh, this tank is now coming finally in another, well, 11 hours. 5 hours, 4 hours, 3 hours, 2 hours and boom. Let's see, are you gonna be assigned right here? That's the big question. Everyone right here, hold, hold, and you hold. Then take, no, 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 you're gonna hold. Come on, hold. I waited a couple hours. Cool, now everyone at the same time attack, which means everyone is, well, engaged in combat in the one. Well, uh, in the same battle at the same time and while well, my super heavy tank is definitely doing better than everyone else and there we go that city disappeared and it's now under my control let's see you were at 24% right now let's see what happens once I grab you come on there we go really super heavy tank oh right it's a river right here that's why they became well I ride faster than anyone else. That was 2%. Really? 2%? And let's see. I have another city right there, which is 3 points. Let's just sign everyone right here and just, well, grab it. 
that's gonna be well a lot of free territory as well and it seems like you're split yourself up pretty goddamn well so I don't think I have to modify very much to be able to clean up all this territory so yeah please just move in exactly like that and the same thing right here you guys let's just go like this clean up that thingy you are going in right here clean up the last territory right here excellent uh, yeah let's see yeah England is now invading well Norway once again and it's going fine cool while well, I'm basically taking care of the entire front line you're invading Norway great work uh, you guys should probably just deal with all of these divisions that suddenly appeared right here rather than well do my stupid orders of weird invasions Uh, let's see, 85%. We're probably not going to get a nuke quite soon. Well, we are going to get a nuke quite soon, but I don't know if we're going to get it in time. Oh, we actually have a city right there too. So let's go up right there and grab that one first. So we might be able to nuke this one one time before they take it. <laughs> it feels so horrible. Like, guys, can you, can you not take that city so we can nuke it once before we go? Wow. Wow, how dare I? Come on, another three days. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Uh, let's see, Do where's our strat bombers? Right there. Both of you assigned right here, thank you. When both of you, I mean, these as one and this as one. Come on, get over here. Very good. Just give me another two days. And another 24 hours from now. None is gonna arrive here in time, not even close, so that should be all right. You have 82% natural unity. After this nuke, your I guess you're gonna have 80% or something. But that 80% is gonna help us a tiny bit at least. Wait, really? But it went 24. What? Really? Damn it. Well, it's still fine. Update that interface and boom. Let's throw a nuke down right here. Sorry, sorry. Um, I can't say that name. I can't say that name. Um, wow, that's bright. Really, 82% still. Damn it. Well, I can't do very much about that. Uh, please just move in and grab that city then. <laughs> any other cities? I don't think there should be any more. Not any more. At least that is. Well, higher than one. That should be controlled by Japan then, if anyone. Come on, let's just bring it down. One, two, one, two, one, two. <laughs> Otherwise, we're just moving in, grabbing a ton of extra territory everywhere. Let's see, 18, yeah, it's still, it's still three more percent that needs to be brought down. Come on, just go in and grab it. Go in and grab it, right now. I'm gonna just split up one of these tanks to engage that unit, just to save my poor little marine division that are fighting for their life, even though it's pretty much doomed for them since they don't have any kind of artillery. Who is gonna arrive there first? That's not gonna be their lost city, but it's gonna be, well, one of the few lost ones. Really, you managed to surround a couple of my divisions. Uh, you guys can just, well, try to move out. So some units moving in, some units moving out. No real surprise right there. So please fix that. Uh, seems like we lost some Philippine units. I'm sorry, but that apparently had to be that way. Come on, 16 hours and you are arriving in unknown amount of time. But yeah, this should be very, very short. Come on, really? You managed to assign a unit right there just in time and there we go. Let's see. Come on, please tell me your fault. Two more percent. Where in hell can those two more percent exist? Really, right there. Okay, I want my entire front line. <laughs> no, I don't want my entire front line. I just want the entire south. Just go straight forward. I don't care what you meet, who you meet. Just go straight forward and bring that down. Because I can't really end this episode right now with not bringing them down. That's just, I can't do it. It's basically, otherwise the next episode would be 5 minutes. I don't know, actually, I don't know. It can be 5 minutes, 10 minutes. It won't be exciting, at least. Here, we're gonna bring down Soviet Union, so I need to do it right now. God damn it. 
Just go in, bring him down. Hit him, say, come on, Japan, can't you do something a bit more aggressive? Just go in right here, bring down that little, tiny, tiny city right here. You're basically two provinces. I have half of Russia to move over. Uh, is there any other cities that you have? I don't think so. You have not retaken anything, right? No. It's basically only... Yeah, it's only that left. Come on, let's just save this vision instead of trying to advance weirdly again. Uh, how are we doing with supplies right now? Uh, minus 1.1k motor mechanized and minus 72 heavy tanks. So we're doing fine now after our small changes. Uh, actually, we have two cities right there. One there, one there. So that's not two points. And with all the random provinces we're taking, that might be enough. So instead of this, all of you guys, all of you are gonna go right up there. You are gonna go right there. And then go right there if you can, if you have enough time. No, 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 what are you doing? First right there, and if you have time, right there. Before everyone else arrived. Arrives. Before the em uh, dark times, before the empire. I don't know, somehow that reminded me of that Star Wars quote. I don't really know why, but before the dark times, before the Empire. Maybe in the way I said it, kind of was a bit similar in some way. Uh, let's see, what else are we going to do? What else are we going to do? Uh, not very much. We're just going to sit here and wait until these one small little cities are being taken. And then we'll have peace, finally. Well, we not have complete peace, but pretty much. We have done everything that the campaign asked for us. Let's see uh, if I can just bring that one up. Scroll down right there, bring this down. And that's not the correct one. Let's see, here we go. It was a while ago we had this one open, and damn, that's very, very badly. Here, there we go. Uh, obese America missions and then we have to kill Axis because they are actually healthy. Well, we haven't brought down the entire Axis, we still would have, well, Japan left, but since the game is lagging so incredibly much, it wouldn't be fun. And we have pretty much built up everything, so it should be alright. Oh, uh, God. God damn it, I can't show and um, wave and stuff, do like that. So, I think I actually will. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna end this campaign a tiny bit early in favor of starting new campaigns hopefully you won't complain too much about that but i basically done the harder part even though we are playing with very very difficult enemies with well max stat we are still crushing them with our heavy tanks it could only take time so i, I i'm gonna start a new campaign rather than keeping going keep going with this one for another couple of episodes once we just invade japan um, otherwise, we have followed all the rules, only heavy tanks, 24 marine divisions, that was my own rule I added to this, otherwise I could have just gone mad with marine divisions. Uh, mechanized load, no motorized, no cavalry, only heavy fighters and all bombers, no cast, so we are gone only with tackle bombers. Uh, no destroyers, no subs, no light cruisers, no, we deleted all of those ships in favor of, well, this weird ass navy with only super heavy stuff. Heavy cruisers that we saved from the very beginning, and then we have the battleships and the ca one single carrier, without any planes, of course, <laughs> because that's not super heavy. Uh, come on, y just just bring this down. No, 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 no! You don't. What are you doing? You're supposed to go all the way down to t <laughs> to the city. You need to take perm. <laughs> Otherwise, there's no point in you rushing right there. Let's see, how close are you now to surrendering? 18%. If you just manage to grab anything right there, just just grab the city, and that will be done. So in another 10 hours, armor division number 40 is gonna end the Soviet Union. If not, then the, I call bullshit. <sighs> okay, we need to grab something more. A random province, or just something slightly more. Just move in, move in and grab something. You guys need to grab that city, or you g need to grab this city, of course. So this should definitely be it. So this is gonna be the 56th armor division. It very much might be. There we go. And Soviet Union will fall as soon as the day has arrived. 
a new day a new day in has a new day has come even darkness will pass a new day will come uh, so I don't remember exactly that Sam to throw the quote it seems like Japan got to do their stuff first and they managed to well they decided to liberate a couple nations and uh, I don't exactly know what they did well Soviet Union we are gonna let's see we're gonna of course liberate all the republics because that's the American way liberate all of them we're gonna change government thank you and we're gonna mark you clearly to Soviet and we're gonna just give you all the territory all the territory that is left god the Japan managed to grab a ton of it holy shit oh crap wait we were in the same PC even though what that's that's weird I'm pretty sure we were not in the same PC because you I got that random offer first and now we're actually taking territory I think oh damn it that was not the point that was not the point I was gonna give everything to Soviet Union ah we can just liberate territory we can just return territory that's what it's called there we go just take everything right now press done god this border Russian Federation we are just gonna jump in right here manage occupied territory return territory yeah I want to return everything to the Russian Federation and the United States but we, we what but we just return territory why, why is this not returned to everything what uh, uh, uh. Uh, something's going on right now. Oh crap, I had this one open this entire time. Well, at least you managed to read through that a couple times if you <laughs> if you missed it. Anyway, guys, I really, really, really hope you enjoyed this campaign. And, uh, well, that I will see you guys next time in my next starting campaign. I think it will be Malta, but I haven't 100% decided. If you have anything really good that I missed, please tell me and I will check it out. Anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed it. That you would like, comment, and subscribe as always, and that I will see you guys next time. Bye. Damn it, my camera should be here right now so I can wave goodbye or something. Just imagine me sitting here on the corner and waving goodbye to you guys right now. And bye.